Up until this point, everything in my life revolved around music, and in particular playing the guitar. But that was all about to change. It was a normal Tuesday morning music lesson, but instead of the usual classical studies, I heard something which to me was out of this world. Instead of music composed with traditional instruments, this music was made using sounds. Wow, it was music concrete. Everyday sounds being music. It blew my mind. The possibilities were limitless. I knew then that I needed to understand more about sound. I poured over books and magazine articles. I couldn't get enough. I discovered that sounds in my favorite films, Star Wars at the time, were made by experimenting, sticking microphones in tubes, recording broken televisions. Could it get any better than this? The traditional recording studio was in fact a sonic laboratory. Things could be spliced, reversed, speeded up, constructed from scratch. I was in sonic nirvana. It was time then to decide my future. A sound engineer I worked with in my spare time told me, if you want to be successful, you need to understand what's going on behind the knobs. I knew then that music technology wasn't enough and I entered the world of acoustics. Pure sound understanding. I embarked on my career as an engineer. I learnt how sound was constructed, how it worked in a space. I was in heaven. And through science, I discovered how my beloved guitar made music. I could make the sounds of music in my head come to life. I got to work in studios and on films. Engineering gave me fantastic problem solving abilities. To know what a director meant when he said, it should sound more fluffy. I built myself a studio, my personal sonic lab. And now I've returned to university after many years to study acoustics even further. With access to a lab beyond my wildest dreams.